We are back in the daytime kitchen with Jen Litz from FBS Cafe. And you have a chip in your hand. I, I, I mean, there's <laughs> chips right here. I mean, if you're going to put chips in front of me, I'm going to start eating. Oh, they're free. Them. I know. Go ahead. All right. Thank you. Okay. Thank you so much. No problem. All right. Lamb what are we tacos. Making? Okay. So I already started the lamb. We're using ground lamb. Mm. And then we make a taco blend in house. And then. Uh, so I, I kind of cooked it in advance because I didn't want you to have not done lamb because nobody Thank you. nobody likes that. Right. No. So basically brown it and then add the taco seasoning. Oh. Okay. For if I'm making this at home, effect. can I use like a regular taco seasoning? Yeah, absolutely. Okay. Mm -hmm. um, now, do we put it on? If we uh, do, we cook it and then put it on, or do it during like what during the, the cooking work? process? Okay. Like as it's I was wondering. Brown, I put it on closer to the end of it browning, and okay. then just to let it cook in a little bit and absorb some of the flavor. Got it. And then uh, I would have added fresh garlic to it, but um, that's what we have at the restaurant. But I forgot to bring some, so oh. we're just gonna imagine. Hey, but they have it there. Right. All right. But we're just gonna okay. imagine at the home fresh you're garlic. You're gonna add that. Okay. Yes. So you're gonna add that at home, and then you're gonna cook it until it's brown. You'll kind of have to break it up too. If okay. you like bigger pieces of it, you can leave it larger. Right. And then. I've never We're done this a with a lamb. Does it take a little bit longer than like a ground no, beef? No, it's actually, I found it to be a little faster. I mean, I'm using a much more higher powered oven at work or, st or stove right. burners are right. hot. So yeah. um, at home, I, maybe I'm having a bad comparison there, but actually pretty fast. Okay. Okay. All right. So we're going to take, so we uh, cook these on our open grill. So I did that before I came here. Okay. And there's two per order. So I'll just make one so for each So do you prefer you. soft or, or hard, hard tacos? tacos. Uh, depends if I'm drunk or sober. If I'm oh. drunk, I love crunchy tacos. Um, but I, <laughs> I really like soft the tacos. The okay. Yeah, I find that if you're sending people home with like to-go orders of crunchy tacos, those shells can really fall apart. So these Got are it. nice and durable. I like this. So we're okay. gonna put up in this. Hold on one second. Okay. We don't <laughs> want to burn. Nope. No, no, over there. no okay. I don't need to start any fires today. So no. first, we're gonna put a little bit of lamb in each taco. Mm -hmm. Yes. Smells delicious. I know it really does. It's a really. That's got to be the seasoning too, because you all have the best sauces. Mm. Thank you. And then yeah, of course you, you have your spices, but this the seasoning I'm I'm assuming is great too. It's yeah. It's it's. Do you put that on anything else? On this. Um, on the seasoning. We do a something really similar for our shredded chicken tacos. Okay. Um, there's a it's it's an almost identical blend. It's a little bit different just for the type of meat that we're using. Got it. All right. So and then our. Not completely purple cabbage slaw, right, <laughs> like right. we put on everything else, uh -huh. and the cotija. Oh, what kind of cheese is this? It's cotija cheese. It's a. Did you guys talk about that? Because a little bit, that. yeah, 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 yeah. A what bit. is that? So this is a. It's a cow's milk cheese. It's mm -hmm. from Cotija, Mexico, and it's a hard cheese, mm. and it crumbles, and it actually it doesn't seem like it, but it melts really well. Okay. And it's a really it's mild in flavor, but it. It complements the lamb really well. Mm -hmm. Okay. And then a little bit of red onion. Does one of you not like onion? Do I, I love onion. Go Good. ahead and pile them Good? on. Okay, cool. Go ahead. I'm okay you, with that. Or you can leave one off. I'm going to leave it do off. Do one so we'll, onion, one okay, not. Okay, for the onion lovers and not. And right. then <laughs> a couple radishes. We can get a nice crunch. I know. Oh, yeah. I like that. Crunch I, is very important to me. Mm -hmm. okay, it's pretty. Okay. And then cilantro. Of course. Now, do you put lime on this? I'm going to give you two wedges of lime. I recommend squeezing it over top. You um, got it. We always serve our tacos with lime. That way people that, you know, want it have the option to. And, of course, black sesame seeds. All right. And we right. are offering up the recipe on our website, daytimebluerich.com. Just look for lamb tacos. In the meantime, order yours today at FPS Cafe and Spirits, located on Jefferson Street inside the Patrick Henry, fpsroanoke.com. All right. All right.